I'm Rob Boyle from Coolidge, Arizona. We're out in one of my uh, cover crop fields. This is a, a first year experiment for me. After reading a lot about cover crops and different publications, uh, we decided to do a little experiment on some of our tougher fields and one good field. We planted 12 pounds of hairy vetch. Um, the goal here would be really just to kind of change up the, the monoculture I've kind of created in my cropping system. Th this field was alfalfa. It went into corn. Now it's got to be corn for two more years before we go back into alfalfa. So if we can just create a little diversity and, and help build soil health. This field came out of corn. We ran uh, 20 tons of manure onto it. Then we came back in with a high speed joker disc and uh, then drilled 12 pounds of vetch in. And the goal is get it up 10, 12 inches tall. Um, I don't know if we're gonna have to do a burn down or if we can just shred it and then we're going to come back in, strip till, and plant corn. If this works, I've read we could get 100 units of nitrogen, clear up to 150. Um, I'd be happy if I got 30. You know, I'm just doing it kind of to see what it'll do to the health of the soil. Uh, that's our biggest thing. And uh, we just didn't want to have to keep disking this ground and controlling the weeds and uh, just to have something growing all the time and see if that doesn't help the bi biology of the soil. and. Uh, just, just help us achieve higher yields down the road. Um, we had a big toss up this year, even um, going into turnips. Uh, we were debated about playing around with some turnips or what we should plant. And off a few recommendations, we came up with the, the hairy vetch. But what I'm looking at is my wells, you know, we get canal water and well water here. Uh, my canal water is getting rationed down uh, so in the heat of the summer, I have to cut back my growing uh, acres of different crops. But in the winter time, I have an abundance of water. So what I'm looking at is with the effluent water coming off my dairy and the excess well capacity, if I could grow a crop cheaply, not put a whole lot of money into it, but build the soil back up and generate a little fertilizer for the next year and cut back on commercial fertilizer, I definitely look at expanding this into you know, not just, you know, a tenth of my corn acres, but maybe looking at all my corn acres. And uh, maybe do vetch one year, maybe radishes the next, or, or start combining things from there, just depending on how the first year turns out. 